So I wanted to just show how you get bubbles in the belly pore system. So I'm going to collect the first sample with the scepter upright. So you'll see I have it submerged the entire time. So it says. Characterize, hold down the plunger, submerge. Samples loaded, calculating, and what you can see here is that there's some bubbles. It actually messes up the count to give us uh, these low volume events at the bottom. So the count here with the bubbles, uh, of course I can gate them out, but with the bubbles we're at about 700,000 per mil. So now what I've been doing is as soon as a sample as I turn it upside down so now if there are bubbles in there, they're going to be at the top and not be taken into the chamber here. So now, the count I'm getting is about 300,000 per mil. Again, that's excluding all those bubbles. So you get a much more accurate count holding it upside down.